That's exactly how I feel. It means you regret playing it? What do you mean you regret it? But it's for the glory! Yeah, I'll take fucking first room. You know what? That's worth just using the card. First item, Hemolacria. Probably not the best of situations, but I'm gonna take it because it's funny and cool. <laughs> Dog, I did not even try endless mode. I'm like, there's no shot. <laughs> like, I know in my video I didn't show any of the footage of me playing, actually playing the game, but... On the second round, when I was, like, forced to get the good ending, I fucking was Im immensely careful. Like, the amount of time I took per burger flip was ridiculous. I did not want to <laughs> go and do endless mode, knowing just how long I would be fucking stuck in it. <laughs> nice! My holy card. That's okay, this is gonna drop small rock. Damn. But imagine? But imagine? Is this still basement two? This is basement one. Oh my god, it took two shots. There we go. Honestly, I've been thinking about playing Kaizos, because I'm just, I'm just out of regular hacks to play, and like the, you know, the regular hack that I found to play, that shit is pain incarnate. I might as well be playing, I might as well be playing a Kaizo. I think, though, to be real with you... I think I just need a new controller. I think, like, I think 99, and I, I know that it's, like, the quintessential, like, excuse to be like, oh, it's my controller's bad, I'm not bad, but, like, legitimately, I, I think 99.9% .9 of my issues with Mario right now and the reason I'm kind of feeling off, I think it has nothing to do with the game and everything with to do with the controller. I think it's just straight up the controller. Like... Yeah, my controller is dog shit. Dude, if I push up left or up right, it takes, like, a second for the controller to realize I'm pushing one of those two directions. So Mario has to, like, stop moving and then start moving. It's awesome. <laughs> so I think that's gonna be... I, I wanna... I'm gonna ask in, like, one of the main ROM hack servers once I get some money. I'm gonna ask if people can recommend like a a GameCube controller to USB and I might pivot to using a GameCube controller. Cause I have one in a box somewhere that I would be able to dig out. I would just need to buy an adapter. And I figure, you know, buying an adapter for an already existing GameCube controller is probably far cheaper than buying a new Switch Pro controller that's also gonna start drifting in a little while. I know you hate do I not have Dies of Cringe enabled? That's cringe. That's more cringe than anything I could have said. Hold on. Game I know you hate GameCube controllers because you have <laughs> large hands. Uh 7 TV. <laughs> Lives from based. There. I fucking love GameCube controllers. You know what they say about guys with big hands? They have a hard time holding controllers. You know, I don't I don't have a holy card. I'm kinda just like <laughs> screwed. How did that count as a backstab? He was, like, running towards me.
This run is going to end in, uh, in sadness. Complain about game controller. I think, but I think I would, I think it would take some adjustment, obviously, but I think I would enjoy it. And I think, like, what, a 20 to $30 adapter is not enough money to be, like, to make me feel bad if it turns out to be bad, I guess. Secret room is not there. Uh, oh, secret room literally has to be here. Pretty cap. Oh, I had to try. Give me the pill. Tears up. Uh, Rafnet. Is it expensive? Do not buy Rafnet adapters in 2023. Hashtag shorts. Hashtag clone hero. Oh, this would be good for the Wii Classic controller, which I do own. I do own a Wii Classic controller. <laughs> oh, that would be cool, because then I could play... Uh, I could use that for Dolphin as well. $26 is not unreasonable. I'm going next week down to... Uh, There's a there's a high school over by my mother's house that's hiring tutors, so I was gonna go down there for an interview on next week, sometime next week. I would love to have money to spend on a <laughs> on a controller adapter. So I may do that. Thank you, contract from below. Hey, holy card. Good to see you again. Yeah, but I fucking hate Xbox controllers and don't even want to think about holding one in my hands. <laughs> I apologize for the aggression. <laughs> no, I, I really don't like Xbox controllers, though. Like... With the DualShock? Is, the, is DualShock the PlayStation controller? I don't mind. The I like the PlayStation controller. I don't hate it, but... I still vastly prefer Nintendo's controllers. Like, all of them. Yeah, I can't stand Xbox controllers. I just don't like the feel of them. I hate the analog stick. I hate the triggers. I hate the D-pad. <laughs> Oop. Uh, caves. I understand, because they're like, um... How would you how, how would you call them? Parallel, I guess? Mirrored? It's a mirrored controller, as opposed to most controllers, which have the left stick higher than the right stick. Give me perfection. I will settle for nothing less. Um, I guess I'm leaving. That can't be secret room. Okay, secret room I think has to be here. Show me small rock. Never. I'll never <laughs> be able to get small rock. Um, 
top secret room is... Yeah, I guess here. That makes the most sense to me. Yeah, it's nothing. Alright, oh, and away we go. To be honest, like, the re the thing that prevents me from being a, a total PlayStation shill with regards to controllers is, like, the stick height, I guess? And, like, the reason I hate Xbox sticks is because of the little, like, bucket formation that they have. Where it, 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 it's like a crater, it's like... It goes downwards in the middle and then slopes upwards. Like, I don't, I don't like that feeling. But I think PlayStation does the opposite, and it's a correction too much in the opposite direction. It, like, slopes in the other direction too much. As opposed to, like, a game controller, which has very, very minimal slope. And I, I like the texture of a game controller. Stick. I DK. That's, that's just my plan, uh, at present. to get a job and then spend job money on an adapter that would let me use a GameCube controller. So I got a bunch of them in a box. You know, might as well use them. Yeah, let me just walk up to the bomb fly. Or the boom fly. Gotta use official names. Where's that shop at? Oh, I've already been to the shop. I could play Crane Game, but the first item that was in the Crane Game was D8 or D7, and it's that's just a terrible item. Shiny Rock. Tears up. Very nice. No, don't ever take Little Portal. Sooner restart than take Little Portal. Cursed. Absolutely cursed item. Never take it. I'd rather roll on this claw machine. Yeah, that is D7. I guess, honestly, D7 wouldn't be terrible. Ooh, Consolation Prize would be good, too. Are your house sitting in? Nice. Uh, Fire rates. And then randomly choose three coins or a bomb. In the living room or the bedroom? Ooh, good question. Because I have to imagine the living room has the better TV. But I also have to imagine that the bedroom would be comfy to sleep in the in the bed. Or to lay down in the bed while you play. Oh, they're pretty equivalent. I guess the... I guess the living room, then. That's usually what I do. The past couple times I've gone to, uh, gone back to house sit for my mother, I, I set everything up in my in the living room. Like I even just played on the computer in the living room, <laughs> on my laptop with a fucking, you know those wooden tabletops that everybody used for dinner all the time. And then I just owned the, the living room. But also, to be fair, though, when I was house-sitting, they have a dog. So it was nice to be in the living room with the dog so that she feels like she has somebody there. I mean, she does have somebody there, so it would, it's not, no feels like about it. Interesting that if a card spawns with contract from below, it has to be a duplicate, but if a chest does, it doesn't necessarily have to have duplicate contents. Looking after a cat. Cats are a lot more self-sufficient than, uh, 
than dogs. I need to start re-rolling some of these rooms. Not this one, because this is ass, but, you know, some of these rooms. No! Okay, we're good. I wasn't even scared, actually. Okay, gold bomb and gold key. What the hell? Serious liquid kind of sucks, but it is just okay. It is okay. Wait, that can't, that literally cannot be the secret room. What am I doing? I should not reroll that room. That would be a bad idea. I really want to find a good room to reroll. I guess probably this one. Uh, there's got to be a better one. That's a very large chest. Okay, this is the room. Pills. This is also a good candidate. That moon card is nice, but not nice enough to warrant replacing what I do have. Thank you, loud ass car. I'll take blue maps since I'm rolling in dough. this room nothing I guess I could just hold down the button like there's no reason for me to actually precisely aim especially considering I have mysterious liquid I'm missing out on some slight DPS just by virtue of having mysterious liquid Brimstone bombs is really, really, really good. Um, but so is duality. Do I go duality and then start pivoting towards angel items? I don't know how much I care. I think I take headless baby and go for um conjoined. Okay, we'll do that. What's in here? Pentagram? That might be... That's, uh... That's very tempting. Dead Sea Scrolls? Don't make me laugh. Not funny. Didn't laugh. Please. not a room I want to be in. Anything good in the shop? Uh, Pokey goes good. Placebo would be good if I um, knew what my pills were. Potentially. I don't actually, maybe it wouldn't be good. What the fuck pill could possibly be so good that I would want to actually placebo it? The world may never know. Is this depths 2? It is. Which means we're not going to be able to go to it anymore. Shops after this. I mean, this is a perfect, uh... This is a perfect room to respawn. 
What are you? Range up? That one's unidentified. I can see forever doesn't matter. Because I have blue map. But hey, it'll save us like a couple bombs. I really have to go through this scary ass thing. Do this room again. It's just two Larry Juniors, like free, literally free. Okay, that was like the worst Pokey Go roll I've ever seen. I don't know what determines, because I know that um, whatever the egg item is. Oh. Well, I'm going to do this room several more times. Uh, the egg item uh, literally doesn't work with Tainted Lost, but it's based on how many rooms you've gone since you last took damage. Whereas, I think Poke goes literally just random. I don't know what, I don't know what determines it. Have I got an item room? Yes, I have. Oh man, so many red hearts. That's lovely. I don't know why I'm even doing this. Like, what could this possibly give me that would actually be worth it? I guess gold chests with items in it. <laughs> if I had to be uh, a little picky and try and pick something that I would love to see from respawning the room and fighting it over and over again. It would have to be gold chests with items in it, if nothing else. Fortunately, not getting any of that. Your soul is useless. Apologies for the roast, but it's not very good. Damn, you let me put so many coins in there? Okay, let's fight, uh, fight mom. Oh, it's blue mom. At least Mysterious Liquid's a good, um, a good item for this fight, <laughs> and I mean, I guess, like, literally only this fight. What the fuck else is this this item good for? Perfect. Give me negative again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I see Brimstone, yeah. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. It's, uh, there's no question. <laughs> it's not... Yep. We're taking Brimstone. Don't care, didn't ask. You there. Give me an item. Mom's bottle of pills. You're an asshole. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Definitely not respawning that room. No. 
That was fucking close. Jesus. Just get hit by the laser already. What are you doing? Can I? Okay. I was like, can I respawn this room? No. No, you cannot. Box. Show me a holy card. Uh, not this time. Moon? Eh. That will do nothing for me. Speed up. Do I want Berserk? No. Uh, do I want Azazel's Rage? Claim four rooms upon a... Yeah, sure. Bob's Curse. Pandora's Box. Till the end. Um, if I take it to Shoal, I get a devil item. Wait, do I have moving box unlocked? Do I have moving box unlocked? I could go for an achievement right now if I wanted. Um, that's a good question. View my achievements. Search. Moving. Yes, I do have moving box unlocked. Okay. In that case, let's use Pandora's box right now. In today's video, we're going to open Pandora's box. Um, mm, boss room is probably bottom left, I guess. What a weird room. How do I know when the the laser is about to go off? Does it just go off and then do, not tell me? Yeah, I guess it just doesn't tell me. There's no warning, but that's okay. I don't really need a warning. I'm so fast. I'm like way too fast. Blow that up, blow that up. Um, yeah, I'll go play through this room two more times, I guess. Bombs are key. No, I think I'm good on that. Fight the same room again. Okay. That kind of sucks. I would have liked to have that for the boss, but oh well. Vis is the, or Vis or Vis, I don't know. Probably the best uh, helper to get from PokeGo for sure.
Death's List or Maw of the Void? Maw of the Void would give me Leviathan. Uh, Death's List will never work, so take this, I guess. Leviathan does nothing for me, however. <laughs> but, I mean, it, it was two items that were both do nothing. What do you choose? Oh, I guess I take the item that does nothing. Like, now sometimes I can mob the void, but will I ever want to? No. Should I ever want to? No. Come on. You know what I would actually love is a, um... Oh, God. Another item towards conjoined. Because if I had conjoined, I'm pretty sure I'm only one item away. And I just shot, like, three Hemolacria Brimstone Tears every time I shot. Oh, be beautiful. That was kind of close. <laughs> All right, listen for the sound cue. And bomb. Okay, one cycled. Or one shot, even. Perfect, perfect Satan fight. Okay. On to Dark Room. What do you take here? Probably, oh, uh, Rotten Baby would give me Conjoined. Uh, Rotten Baby and Jello are both super good. I guess you take Rotten Baby for Conjoined. For more lasers. Yeah, I think that's too, too good to pass up, to be honest. Whoa, don't shoot homing tears at me. I think on their own, Rotten Baby wasn't the choice, but because Rotten Baby gave me conjoined, it's what made it, what made it the uh, the answer. How many famines are in here? Eternal D6 and Brown Nugget. I don't want to reroll. Yeah, I do, and I destroyed both of them. I was gonna say I don't want to reroll D7 because more chances it items, but no, that's just straight up the right answer. I thought that Vis was an enemy for a second. Bone Spurs, Pinking Shears. I think we reroll. Well, we definitely take Tech Point 5, even though I don't know that it's going to do anything. We definitely take Capricorn. And we hope that we're strong enough to beat the uh, lamb. No, I w actually, that's I'm okay with wasting my um. I should not have eaten those. That's okay. Please, you need to die now. Perfect. Perfect! Okay, that's another post-it down. Wow.